Well, I caught you lying. You got mad. I did. Okay, and then what, and when you got mad, you went and fucked somebody else. I was mad at me. Okay, but you went and fucked somebody else. I did. Because you got caught lying. Yes. And now this person is now... So mad at me. Now this person is now texting you, saying that he was with you actually all night. He was not. Okay, but so he's lying. He is lying. Okay. He is lying. That's a big, fat fucking lie. He's saying last Friday night, last Friday night. What does Katy Perry voice mean? I have no idea. I don't know what he's talking about. So he's lying. I think he was with somebody else before he got to me. That's what I think. Okay. Well, he thinks he had sex with you all night. He didn't. Did you blow him near the couch? Yes. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. So... This is what a lot of you guys, I just took a poll recently asking about going through a woman's phone. This is what a lot of you guys are going to do once you find what it is that you're looking for in her phone. And you're going to conduct yourself like this simp detective here. And the things you guys were saying on that poll is just astounding. I have to know, I have to know, I have to know. But once you find out, you're going to interrogate her like this. And you can say, well, JR, he's probably using it for court purposes, so on and so forth, so she can admit. Nah, man. He, he, he's he's going to use it. He's got her on video asking her all these questions, getting upset. This woman is clearly like, she has, the thing about it, when you go through a woman's phone, she loses all respect for you. She knows that you're a simp for going through her phone, regardless of how manly you think it is. She's looking at this guy, interrogating her like, this fool, I'm sitting up here. He went, he read the messages. What else, what else is there to talk about? You read the messages. So she's, you, you may say she's lying and saying all these other things. I blew him by the couch. This woman ha does not give a F about this dude. She's just like, I'm just with him. He's boring as hell. I'm just with him just for whatever. And she probably really doesn't even care if he files for divorce anyway. You guys think that filing for divorce for adultery, if she's already working that alimony stuff, I mean, it is what it is. But this shit is just funny as hell how she's just so nonchalant about it. Like, okay, yeah, I fucked him. I blew him by the couch and he fucked somebody before he fucked me. He fucked somebody else before he fucked me. It's just like, how does that make you feel as a man that this some guy that's fucking another bitch fucked your wife right afterwards? Like... <laughs> Yo. Wait, right when he walked in the door. Okay, so wait, right when you walked in, you went out sucking his dick. Yes. Okay. Well, he re he, he references that. So he's he knows it's you. Yeah. Okay. He's talking about being with you all night. He wasn't. Yeah. We didn't leave the restaurant until ten thirty. You just okay. heard that. Okay. Well, there was but, nothing but, to preface but, 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 that. But she didn't say that you weren't with him as well. All right. She probably won't take the call since you hung up on her. But go ahead and. Um, you, okay, now, do you feel bad at all that you did what you did? Oh, my God. What the fuck? Yes, I do. do you... She's challenging him like, dude, you a fucking uber simp. That's why I'm cheating on your bitch ass. Like, do you feel... That's how you guys... You guys... You detectives out there. Do you feel bad that you sucked this guy's dick behind my back by the couch? And she's just putting it on like, yo, yeah, I feel bad. You guys are weirdos, man. What feel bad about? I feel bad that, well, for a hundred different things, I feel bad. Starting backwards, or starting at the end and working backwards, I felt absolutely terrible that I cheated on you. Mm -hmm. Well, did you, did you feel bad that you lied to me? Well, oh. I was getting there. I told you I was working from the end and going backwards. Okay. The worst thing that I've ever done is hurt you. Okay, so but so when you when you when you got but so, so tell me more about the logic of you fucking getting caught lying, and then because that's what hurts the most, right? You you see what I'm saying? Once you get to that point where she knows that you your emotions are invested, like he's literally got her on camera, questioning her, interrogating her, like how do you think that makes a woman feel? All right, JR, you're simping right now. How do you think that makes her feel, especially if you just talk to her like that in general? Anytime you're talking to your woman, you're interrogating her. 
She feels like a little child. Look how she's sitting. She's sitting like a child. Like a father would be chastising the daughter. So, of course, she's going to be that rebellious child and go suck another dick. Not to say the child would, but basically to, basically to be that rebellious and just say, I'm going to go ahead and fuck this guy anyway. Because you, it's just like uh, you, you try to tell your child not to do something, they're going to go and that makes them want to do it more. She has no respect for this dude. He's sitting up there. He's just embarrassing himself. Sheesh. You go suck some other guy's dick because I caught you lying. How, how does that work? I was an She's like, this guy is such a fucking loser. I can't even believe it. I'm still married to this chump. I have to live my life. And same with you guys who are going through these phones and doing these interrogation tactics. I have to spend my time with this kind of guy. This is this is what my life has come to. You can just see it on her face. This is what my life has come to. I have to spend the rest of my days. <laughs> so poor and deserve to be treated like one. It was self-mutilation. It was self-pleasure, baby. It was self-pleasure. You were just pleasing yourself. I don't know how to behave like this. Guys, she's just like... I don't know how to behave like this. Why are you questioning me? I'm just gonna do it again. This is this is routine. It's not gonna be the first pipe I blow. I'm gonna blow a few other pipes. You know, you're just forcing me into doing this because you're just so lame. So we're gonna cover those poll results later, man. But let me know you guys' thoughts below on this. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit me up on Calendly and Linktree to book a one-on-one -on -one with yours truly, as well as picking up all my products, books, Shirts, merch, all that other good stuff. And with that being said, peace be upon you all. This is Wisdom. I'll catch you guys on the next one. I'm out. Peace. It's God's true beef maker. And I don't know. I will put a light in the sky for the G's that done turn memory from God. Blessings we send to the ghetto you them.